<laughs> Ro, whenever you get situated, you can unmute. Okay, so do you guys think that men are supposed to protect women? Would you say you press text? Protect. Uh, hold on. <clears throat> I mean, your audio. Unmute real quick. Oh Lord. Yeah, my audio. Okay, next person. <laughs> Do you think women, men are supposed to protect women? I think your 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 family, your your general, your family, mama, sister, daughter, aunts, uncles, not no random Joe Blow getting beat up in the streets. Okay. Okay. Well, why are you supposed why are you supposed to protect your aunts and stuff like that? Because that's the family, man. It's family. What you mean? <laughs> you gonna let your aunt get beat up? <laughs> God, I Nigga, why are you confused that time? If yo, if your aunt was uh, arguing with her husband, would you, would you try to break yeah, that? That's up? different. Actually, I don't. No, know. no, 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 no. You can't you be messing with saying? my. Uh, you can't be messing with my aunt. No, 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 no. You see how he just switched it up? Now it's, <laughs> now, it's now it's different. You see what I'm saying? And that's if the it's, thing. It's like, my, no. If it's my aunt and it's the uncle by marriage, and my uncle might get a. He said by marriage. Uncle yeah, by like, marriage. Yeah, like he married into the family. He might he might get an elbow to the to the to the teeth. What? Yeah. Ladies, lady, let's ask the ladies, and then we're gonna watch this little video. Do y'all think that men should protect women? Absolutely. The Bible said <laughs> a man is well. A man is really supposed to protect. How y'all how y'all doing tonight? <laughs> hey, hey, well, the Bible said a man's supposed to protect, provide, lead, and love his family. Now. I know you can't jump out there for every woman, but in general, that's the man's role to be the protector. Hmm. But who? Is, but here's the question: Who is his family? His wife, mm -hmm. his daughter, his wife and his daughter, his mom. No. His sister. Well, well. No. Originally, originally, it should your wife and your child. That's Correct. your that's immediate what, that's family. That's the Bible is speaking of when yeah. it comes to this yeah, family. yeah. Y'all, y'all throw some extra in there. That's not what it says. Well, I mean, no, that's the truth. But I'm just saying, if you were with your mom and something went down, you're you're going to protect her. No, 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 no. I'm going to protect a woman that's under my covering. My covering. So if you're with me, that means that you have to subject yourself to me. Hmm. In Absolutely. Order, in, in order yeah. to get my protect, see, I'm not by default just crashing out for any woman, right? I'm going right. to make sure, but see, here's the key though. Protection also comes along with y'all paying attention and doing what I say before you get yourself in trouble in the first place. Mm -hmm. So if I tell you, if if I tell you, hey, be quiet, sit back, step back, but you still want to do what you want to do, then that means that you leave my cover, right? Because mm -hmm. I'm not going to put myself at, at odds in for a woman that's unruly or is not willing to listen to what I tell them to do because protection is a multitude of things. It's not just the thing that y'all think it is and a man crashing out when you go and say, hey, he hit me in the eye. Because I could have prevented you from getting hit in the eye in the first place and we wouldn't even be in this situation. And so that's that, the thing that's that women, true. women need to understand that, first of all, if you're not under my covering, then you're not under my protection. And then B, that means that you're gonna have to submit yourself 100% to what it is that I tell you to do. And 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 that ex expectation is set before you even leave the house. You as a woman, in a lot of instances, need to be seeking understanding as to what it looks like to be a part of what it is that I am before we even leave the house. Because what women don't add as a part of this is that you are a reflection of me when you leave with me. Mm -hmm. So how you dress, how you talk, how you walk, how you have a conversation with men, and the whole thing mm -hmm. is... If you are under me, then you are a reflection of me. Mm -hmm. And if you can't abide, if you can't abide by that, then you gotta go. I agree with that. Here's the key that most men miss. You're absolutely right. Here's the key that most men miss. God said, um, "Follow man as he follows Christ." The problem with most men is they're out of order. They're not following following the heavenly Father through Christ. That's the problem. I'm I'm gonna you know? just, just for the sake. Hold on, of hold, on hold on, hold on, Quinn, hold on, Quinn. How do you know? Because I read the word and I'm grounded in Christ. And that's what. Wait, 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 wait. Let's, let's, let's have a conversation. Uh -huh. Follow, you follow man the Bible, you're going to lose. Right? Here's, the, here's my question. Why would a woman be up under a man or subjecting herself to a man 
in the first place that wasn't doing what he's supposed to do. Because what happens is they find themselves in a relationship, opening up their legs, having whole conversations, participating in this whole thing. And then they say, well, I don't want to follow you because you're not doing what you're supposed to do. Well, you knew he wasn't doing what he was supposed to do when you decided to have a conversation with him in the first place. So now, now, how is it her place to determine whether or not he's doing what he's supposed to do when it wasn't her place when she evaluated whether or not she wanted to be with him in the first place? Because if that's the case, that means she should have stayed up under her father until she found herself in a position to be handed over to her husband. That's but if a true. woman is in a if a woman is in a relationship with a man by default, she mm -hmm. follows him. She's supposed to follow him no matter what, whether he going right or whether he go wrong. If you're gonna be up, if you're gonna be with him, then you got to be up under him. But you can't pick right, and choose. But, right, but see, of uh, the problem is a lot of people aren't honest up front. Sometimes in getting to know a person, you don't really, you know, because people tell you what they want you to know, what you want to hear. So until you see the whole picture of, you know, till you get to really know a person, you don't know who they following. People can talk of the representative is, is amazing until the representative dies. So a lot of times women don't know that this man is not the man for them until a situation happens or as she getting to know him, you know, nope. as time goes on and vice versa. That's true. We, we don't get there. I'm, I'm going to let everybody else answer too, but we don't get there. But, but the thing about it is also with the lack of fathers being in the home, where are these women knowing what's right of the man leading if they don't have their father true. teaching them first? That's um, true. Not only that, so women are prone to follow. So we're going to go away from the word submissive because that's a trigger word for women. But <laughs> women are women are prone to. So that's when I say when I say that they're prone to follow, it's more easier for them to intake in the ears when they say follow. So they are they're prone to follow. Me. So with, if a father is in the home and he has to give his daughter away. And if you have a father in the in the house, it, if your father is vet, your your father also vets that man also. That the mm -hmm. father also knows what he can give you away too. But if you if he's not giving you away, how do you know if the man is the right leadership? What what, yeah. what knowledge do you know? Mm -hmm. So when you say men are not following anything, what do you know if you had not had a man before him teach you that? So where are y'all getting this 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 thing that a man's not leading right? Or he does not know how to lead. How do you know? That's, that's not what I said. I said a lot of problems. A lot of the problem is when uh, when God tells you to follow a man, he said, follows follow a man as he follows Christ. That's what I said. The problem is a lot of men are not following God through Christ. A lot of men have a God complex. I'm a king. I'm a man. Just follow me. No. Who are you following? Let's establish that first. That's the problem. And yeah, if, there, if there's not a man in the home, that's really your first example of a, a re representation of God, a representation of strength, who to follow. That's almost that's like you're you're he's teaching you how to date. That's like your first experience of a man, a boyfriend, dating, all of that. Yeah, if the man is not in the home, then yeah, that's that's a that's a that's something that's lacking in you. And a lot of women have that issue. Okay, so what is another, what, what, what is what does that look like for atheists? <laughs> oh, y'all are non-factor, so don't even worry about it. If you're an atheist, you're a non-factor. <laughs> Can't even. But, do <laughs> so, so if you go, so even if you go back to that, though, right? If you said that they're not following God, the teachings, we're, there's not enough teachings from men. Period. Because now, when you're talking about the Bible, a lot of you women are being taught by other women. Again, the leadership comes from the man. The leadership comes from the man. If you're leading from a woman, that's still the most confusion that you have of how do you know what God looks like when you don't have it from a God complex of a man teaching you?